This is the last of the eight game reports from Tuesday's semifinal round at Hillcrest. Um, Dallas, M Dallas HSAA versus MHEA of Memphis. This was the most exciting game of the day. Went down to the final possession. First, I'd say one of the things that struck me was how good the guard play was in this game. Dallas was victorious, but I'll start with MHEA. Rayshon Benson, number 25, what a player he is. He was um, aggressive throughout. I saw him play at tip-off. He is as good of a guard as, as you're going to find here in Springfield. And he was great. He gets real low to the ground. He's real powerful off the dribble. He was great last night. And his backcourt mate, Foster Hawk, another guy I've seen before. I hope I pronounced his name right. Um, he seemingly made every shot he took. Um, I, I'm sure he missed some, but, but he was... Um, very efficient, made shots, um, both catch and shoot threes, made some little floaters going to the basket. He's a very good player, very, very much a competitor. He plays very well when the games are very important, and that's a great thing. Now, Dallas, on the other hand, was dynamite as well. Playing with foul trouble, Nick Thomas was very good. He, um, this is the first time I've seen him play, and he was, he was very good. Um, and then also, I hope I, I don't have uh, information in front of me, but if, if the other guard is named Conway Chris, um, you know, it seems like maybe it would be Chris Conway, but I think the, the, uh, the the media guide says Conway Chris for some reason. But anyway, uh, the, the other guard, and I'll learn his name throughout the week because they won, and so I'll see him some more. But it, he was great, too. Uh, again, like Benson, gets low to the ground, scores, um, handles the ball real well. And there were a lot of other good players, too. Um, but these, these teams went all the way down to the wire, and then the young man whose name I probably butchered or got completely wrong there, made a huge bucket to win the game for Dallas HSAA. They go on to meet the OKC Storm, I think at 2.30 today, for the 6A gold ball. They certainly have their work cut out for them against the Storm, but, um, but it's a good group, a competitive group, and I can't wait to see that game today. I'll see you in the gym.